remains of the day. Can you tell me about it? It's in Scotland. Uh, I was given a year a grant to study a year uh, at the University of Edinburgh, and we lived there for a year. Christy, our daughter, in fact, was born there. Oh. And then one of the spring breaks, we took a trip through the Western Highlands. And, uh -huh. and uh, I always say, if you've got an ounce of Scottish blood in you, you'll leave your heart there. It has an emotional, melancholy beauty. It's not a calendar beauty, it's an emotional beauty, a dreary kind of almost sadness. And here is a picture along Loch Ness. Uh, oh. Many of you have heard of Loch Ness Monster. Uh -huh. well, Nessie's in there somewhere, although she may is not she? Have heard of it. <laughs> But the castle and the, the people who live there and the stories they, they tell and so it's a, it's a picture which calls you back into the mood. Is it cold during this painting? Or? Well, uh, the Scots would tell you, uh, yes. Uh, uh -huh. Actually, uh, it's not all that cold, but I can remember taking notes uh, in class at the University of Edinburgh, and of course there was no central heating in many days. I would uh -huh. take notes with with mittens on because oh, the, wow. the Scots insisted on having the windows open and uh -huh. the American students would insist on trying to close them. So <laughs> always a tug of war who got there first. 